hello pisces and welcome to my channel and today we are gonna do your love reading for the months of october and please keep in mind that these readings are general readings and it may or may not gonna resonate with each one of you so take what resonates and leave the rest pisces and pisces you can also check your near personal relationship spreads on my channel for having more information about your relationship but if you feel like that this one reading is not resonating with you much so you can check your other readings for the months of october on my channel because those readings could be more resonating and more helpful for you so let's get started with the reading spirits guides angels what does the piscean's person is thinking and feeling about them please what does the piscean's person is thinking and feeling about them please so we are having here strength knight of wands chariot ace of cups so what are the piscean's feelings towards this person's spirits so we are having here page of wands king of swords queen of swords three of wands so what's the mutual energy so we are having their ten of cups and five of wands and mutual energy so fiery energy is there okay pisces so science could be related with your person or could be related with you it could be any leo with this strength card it could be any aries leo sagittarius with this page of wands three of wands five of wands with this knight of wands cancer with this chariot card libra gemini aquarius with this king of swords with this queen of swords and cancer pisces scorpio with this ace of cups so let's talk about your person's feelings towards you pisces so Pisces, first of all, we can see two major arcanums in their feeling strength and under the strength we can see chariot here. But first of all, let's talk about this person. So I feel like that they're very attracted towards you. They're very passionate about you with this uh, knight of wands here. So it's like a person who just, um, you know, they see you like this passion, beauty, desire. And they feel like that you are the person who always trigger this person to, you know, rush back or to rush to have you. So this is how they feel about you. But they also feel like that you are very different from the, you know, from other people they have met because you are in your own strength. You are not ready to take less than what you deserve. You are powerful. You are strong. You are independent. So this is what they can see in you. And another thing is that with the strength energy, they feel like that, that you are actually very strong and another thing is that you inspire this person as well you know you inspire this person to be like you and uh, another thing is that that they know that they cannot fool you they cannot play games here with you so if they want to be with you so they will have to give you what you want what you deserve otherwise they cannot be with you but they still want to rush back in your life they still want to you know show you their passion and their you know their energy in this situation they actually want to take control over this situation with this chariot under the strength card so they feel like that you're very powerful and you have control over this situation control over yourself so they are also trying to take control over this situation control over themselves and you know wanting to move this uh, situation towards the right direction but the thing is that they could be not so grown up like you so you could be like this uh, grown up person in strength but they are like this uh, knight of wands here so passionate but the thing is that with this person that they get bored very easily you know so they can easily you know get bored and then they show lack of interest so this is their drawback we can also see their ace of cups so they know that you have capacity to love this person deeply and if they will be able to have you in their life definitely they're gonna be able to have love in their life because you are lovable person and you love this person and you actually love this person in the past and you still love this person so this is what they believe so let's see what we have in your feelings so I feel like that you are being assertive towards this person because you see them like this page of wands and you are right. Here we can see knight of wands. So I feel like that, that you feel like this person is a good person, but they are not so grown up, you know, for especially for the matter of love and long term relationship. So sometimes they could be a big flirt. They only want to flirt and they don't want something serious. And that's why I feel like that you are not with, with this person because you are a serious person. And that's why you are looking for a perfect match for yourself. So if you are this king of swords, logical and mindful, you are looking for a smart person like you, like you are looking for this queen of swords so if you are the queen of swords we're looking for a perfect match 
with you like this king of swords so you both you know grown up so this type of relationship you want and a king and a queen so this type of pairing you want but you feel like that you cannot have a pairing with this person so that's why you could be turning your back from this uh, person and uh, looking for a better situation or a better relation in mutual energy we can see ten of cups and five of wands there so right now you are very clear that you want ten of cups family children something for a long haul completion you don't want any you know stressful relationship in which things are all messed up you want a very smooth relationship here we can see five of wands so five of wands is a clear sign they can see that you are not ready to compromise you are not ready to take less than what you deserve so you, now you are actually challenging this person so let's see what else we have what else for pisces okay so we are having their three of swords and ten of four wands falling out of the deck and in outcome we are having ten of pentacles wow so it's amazing with this three of swords hmm it's connected with the three of wands i feel like that you have broke your heart in this situation just by having high expectations from this you know page of wands so it's like expecting from a child to have a relationship with you so it was like that or have a serious long hold relationship with a you know child here and especially you know and in love situation so it was like that so i feel like that you have broke your heart because of some type of expectations you were having high expectations and they were not having capacity to fulfill those expectations so that's why you have broke your heart so now you don't want to broke your heart in this situation anymore so that's why you could be avoiding the situation turning your back from the situation with the understanding that they are this type of person not so grown up so it's not possible to actually do anything about it we can see 10 of wands so they know that in order to be with you they will have to be a grown up person they will have to take responsibilities but they know that you know without take, you know without um, taking any responsibilities they cannot have you you know they cannot build a relationship with you so we can see 10 of cups 10 of wands but in the outcome we can see 10 of pentacles so definitely possibility is there that they are going to offer you stability security something for a long haul whatever you are wanting they are ready to offer you that they are ready to offer you love if you want love they are ready to offer you stability if you want stability because they really want you because they don't want to lose you because they know that they are losing you they are losing this connection you are not ready to compromise so right now they can see that so in order to be with you now they will have to do something otherwise they have no chance with you and uh, this is what they can also understand so that's why i feel like that they are not done if you are being tough or uh, you know showing them mirror that what they need to do being assertive so it's actually helping this person to take control over this situation so they are not done they are definitely going to offer you whatever you want stability and love in order to have you back in their life because they really want you back in their life here but they can come towards you without um you know any change so you can say that that they are ready to offer you what you want but they could be still not so grown up so if you really want to you know have a relationship with this person you will have to be very patient with this person pisces but now it's your choice that what are you gonna do about this person and about this situation this is definitely up to you this is definitely your choice so let's see what else we have what else for pisces so we are having here getting to know each other as you reveal your inner more self to each other your bond deepens so I feel like that you will have to be your real self with this person. It's like, you know, going in front of the person without any makeup. So just showing who you really are and what your intentions are clearly to the other person. So if you will be true to other person and truthful and honest with the other person, they will also be, you know, honest and fair with you. So it starts with you. If you will be truthful, fearful, and you will say what is in your heart, so they will be also able to, you know, reveal feel their true self and then you can have a strong bond with each other we're also having a past life relationship you have known each other before so i feel like that they have that strong pull towards you it's because of this person is from past or could be from your past life they have a karmic relationship with you and that's why they come back to you <laughs> over and over again and they cannot lose you they actually don't want to lose you because it's a strong connection and that's why i feel like that they are just coming back again so let's see what else we have what else for pipe Pisces. So we are having here not the right time. So whatever you want, whatever you need, you are you are gonna have that on a right timing, on a divine timing. So 
that's why you don't really need to rush over anything if you're not getting it because you will be able to get that on a right timing probably the time is not right so that's why you need to be very patient also we are having here heal yourself pisces enjoy life keep calm and look for spirituality in your life so these are some advices i have for my piscean people there hope it's resonated with you if it's resonated so you can like and subscribe to my channel god bless you pisces and love you so much take care